Hello everyone, how are you today? Uh, today I will explain how to import uh, STL relief file to ArtCam and how to modify its uh, dimensions and position. Uh, then I will explain how we can export a G code to use it for mining a CNC machine. Okay, let's restart. First, I will create a new model. Now, I will determine the uh, y axis height and x axis width of the work area of my CNC machine. And I want to be sure the mark is and uh, the position is down and left of my work area of my CNC. Of course, you want to select your units if you want its millimeters or inches. Then press OK. Now to import the STL file, I need to go to File and Import, then 3D Model. Now that's my STL file. I will open it. Okay. Let's we see now. That's my STL file, but it's terrible. Has no dimensions. It's a wrong position. How can I correct it? The first, I will correct the position and rotate my relief. I will rotate it around Z axis minus 20 degree. Okay. Minus 20 degree. Click apply. Okay. That's first step. Now I want to determine the dimensions. Uh, there's dimensions of X and Y and Z size. Z size remains the height of relief. If I want the uh, width of the relief is uh, uh, for example 60 centimeters, it's 600 millimeter. Okay, we note that Y and Z it's difference too because it's link. All link all axes are linked together. So if I want to separate it, I need to uncheck the link. Now I can define another dimension for Y axis. For example, it's one thousand and 400 millimeter and there the height of the relief um, my material is uh, height is MDF food with height uh, 30 millimeters it's 3 centimeters okay I need to change it first I, un uh, I will uncheck the link of Z axis and define the height of relief it will be 13 millimeters you of course can be uh, put your dimensions the x dimensions y dimensions z dimensions as you want next step i will press apply okay that's the real dimensions i want okay but this is some uh, there is uh, something wrong the positions of the relief is offset on X and Y and Z so I will correct it the table of the upper it's uh, determine the X and Y and Z offset I need I don't need any offset so I will build them all zero and the other thing I need the relief in top and down of my work area of my CNC so I will press apply oh sorry zero zero and Z is zero so apply oh you can see now my relief in the right position and right dimensions so it's okay now I will click paste 
and close there is a part one of uh, my lesson the part two how can I export a G code to uh, using it to import uh, to uh, CNC my CNC program and C studio or Mac 3 or another the first step I will go to 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 2d view and to show relief in the 2d view I will click in preview relief layer okay I can now see it the first step I will surrounding it with a rectangular vector to determine the area I, I need to milling it I need now to make a rectangular with the same width 600 millimeters and 1040 millimeters create it I need to put it surrounding my relief so the exposition will the half of my dimension and the half of my y dimension carry it close now I make a rectangular surrounding the relief my relief now I want to go to toolpath and using machine relief operation okay in machine relief I want not I don't know I don't want to milling all the work area of my CNC table so I will select it vector that's vectors I uh, make it uh, and uh, surrounding of my relief the strategy I prefer raster because it's very good to 3d milling and now I want to I want to choose the tool click select now I'm using a 3d finishing I prefer to using a pole nose 6 millimeters you can use uh, 3 millimeters if you want or 4 millimeters but it's take uh, more times and I use uh, 3 millimeters or 4 meters for a high details relief but there 6 millimeters it's more than enough and faster okay I'll sh I will choose it and um, it, you need to know uh, if I want my relief with high 3 centimeters you need tool to be taller than 3 centimeters because they want to make milling for all 3 centimeters ok now I will set up my material my material with thickness it's MDF wood with thickness 30 millimeters ok you need to know to the material thickness is at least the same tall of Z axis of the relief if it's more than uh, the height of relief for example I have MDF wood with thickness 40 millimeters okay the relief is 30 millimeters high oh that uh, will be a remain of 10 millimeters so you can put it them upper or you can put them lower and you must choose the top offset or bottom offset I prefer to choose top offset to make zero from the heights of my material I need the zero of my tool is upper than my material not upper than my work area of my CNC so will I choose top offset and make the remain of um, of the material the 10 millimeters lower of my relief 
okay now we need to name this operation you can choose any name you want I will name it 3d milling and press now then close it takes some time to make the operation okay if you need to show what's happened you can go to 3d view this red lines show the line of the tool that will milling the relief okay you can show it's the same relief not uh, uh, not goes anywhere else so everything is okay now I will save this operation and turn it to G code I need this operation in the right side of my table if you see it in the left you need to move it to the right and choose the output file is G code if you use inch you must choose inch if you using millimeter you must choose millimeter so I will save it and name it then click save and close everything you can save the art cam if you want in the same folder ok you can show now the G code was created you can take it and import it to your CNC machine program and start milling goodbye